All right, friends, we have made it to day eight. We are over a week officially. Oh, these backgrounds yeah. always like make part of me disappear. Like, oh yeah, no, my hair is going crazy over here. Go crazy. If I go yeah. right here, it goes crazy. But then I, I mean, like I have the, a really good mm. top light, and you can't mm. even see it. It just kind of looks like a mop. I feel like people are going to think that I never move from this chair because I always sit in this chair for all of these and it's like Christmas tree, kitchen. Well, I sit in the same spot. I just have different backgrounds. Yeah, backgrounds. Yeah. Right yeah. now, I'm in Bordeaux. Hey, Bordeaux. Speaking Isn't of, okay, so excellent introduction, Holly, gold star. So we're drinking a Bordeaux wine. Okay, prize for the first person who can name the five grapes that are typically in a Bordeaux wine. Go. Cabernet Sauvignon, Cabernet yes. Franc. Yes. Merlot. Correct. Um, hold on. No, no, no. I got this. Hold on. You got this. Your husband would do it like this. Stop. What are you trying yes. to say? And he got so, I mean, he, he, he was ha proud of himself in Napa for knowing all of these. You're looking at the wrong girl right here. What tell me what one starts with. I can tell you um, what, cheese, what cheese goes with good with Bordeaux. I will give you a hint. We purchased one of these at specifically at Lambert Bridge because it doesn't usually come as 100% this. Petit Bordeaux. But, correct. And... Oh, the last one is Holly. Malbec. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wait, didn't I say Malbec? No, you said Merlot. No, I said Merlot. No. Yes. Huh. Yeah. And do, would you need to be reminded of what kind of cheese goes with? Yeah, I, I do. Love I, to need, know. I would I love to, to know what reminded. kind of cheese. I do, too. Ch cheddar. Oh, yes. <gasps> Guess what I have right here? Cheddar. Oh, easy squeeze. Easy cheese. Cheddar. Oh, she she brought it. That's her I dinner. Cheddar. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I didn't know that was what I was getting, but mm -hmm. yeah, here we go. So, we're <laughs> well, you're eating it before you try it. Oh, she's trying so to mix it in clink, your clink. Mouth. Oh, you, you don't That's mix what it she in now. Mm -hmm. She didn't say that at all. She's oh never said that. Hey, what really? was our quote last night? Did we have a quote last night? I just well, realized we didn't. It was the same Tempranillo, so it was a great little grape. We've we but mm. we we kind of glossed over the Grenache part of it. Oh, you know what I thought about? The rough ride. That's what I thought about. We that was know. that was two nights ago. That was, mm -hmm. yes. that, was a good yeah, one. that one you can't beat. It's kind of good. <laughs> the rough ride. Mm -hmm. That's a good one. It's well done, Stephanie. I like the smell of this one. <laughs> so this welcome. one smells really good. <laughs> I still have cheese residue in my mouth, so I'm gonna go ahead and drink some. So you don't have to brush your teeth later? <laughs> no, we discussed that. I will, however, okay, so going back Ooh. to that, because I feel like I need to I need to expand because other people are gonna be like, oh, she gross. Yeah, I, I'm kind of thinking. No, 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 hold I, on. Say, I will typically that's when I that's when I usually do Listerine. So I do Listerine before I go to bed at, at night. Well, that's yeah. something, but don't you don't you don't need to get that mm -hmm. coffee and red wine and all that off your teeth before you get to bed? Doesn't it feel weird, like sweater? So, <laughs> so I'm really tired and I just, I don't have cavities, so I just don't even bother. I'm like, eh, it'll be fine. I'll brush them in the morning. Okay, okay. JJ. Mm -hmm. Whatever works for you. you oh, Bo, did you want to say hi? Yeah. I don't think oh, is. Bo. But I, I, I am not without, you know, issues because, you know, I have that whole, like, I have the whole dry eye thing. So I have to put, like, goop in my eye before I go to bed every night, which is super annoying. Um, and, and here's my fear. You were talking about, like, the fear that you have of dreaming that your teeth are going to fall out. So here's my fear. Yeah. I fear that I'm going to be old and in the nursing home. And they were not going to put my eye goop in my eyes when I go to sleep. You told me that fear. Yes. And, and I'm going to wake up in the morning and, and my eyes are going to peel off of the layer, which is excruciating, just so you know, Sounds every crazy. day. Because I people you are going that. to, you know, if I'm demented or something like that, they're not going to remember to put the, my eye goop in my eye. 
Well, we just, you know, we know we're all going to outlive our husbands, so we just have to make sure we're all in the same home. Can so. we Can we just plan on being in the same nursing home together? Do you know that there is now a Jimmy Buffett? We're not going to be in a nursing home. There is now uh, I mean, a Jimmy I put too Buffett much in retirement for that shit. Retirement. Yeah. There's right. now a Jimmy Buffett retirement home. Oh. Oh. That that's where we need to go. Okay. Mm. Right. I, I mean, I need to be in some place that is really humid so then I don't have my dry eye problem. So I just need to like grow old and die in the Caribbean. Like an island? Like an island somewhere? Yeah, I want to say it's in Florida. Turks and Caicos, didn't we talk about that? Can we retire in Turks and Caicos? Sure. I'm all in. Okay, yeah. let's do it. Let's do the, it. We'll be sister husbands, wives. Listen, the husbands Grandma will be- Grandma wives. Grandma wives. Exactly, the husbands will be dead because they're all unhealthy and they'll die off. And yeah. we should just, you know, <laughs> <laughs> Move to Turks and Caicos. So we're betting on that. We're betting on that. Says, says, says. I mean, I don't know that I'm putting those eggs in, my, in that basket, considering. <laughs> Just a little paw. <laughs> no, considering no. I'm, I'm already having, you know, uh, hip surgery. So I, I don't know. I mean, I actually, I will actually, I will probably be fine mentally, and I'll probably make it just fine. Hmm. I just, my bones just won't be great. <laughs> So you'll just have to get me there. Yeah. So, so, and this is where Chris comes in because he always jokes around because I, 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 I don't want to be like super old, right? You know, anybody who's in medicine, once you see, you know, yeah. all those people, you're oh, just well, like, I, I know. But here's the deal. So Chris teases me. I'm like, I don't want to live that long. And he was like, here, you know, when he was like mad at me about things, he's like, you know what I'm going to do? He's like, I'm going to freeze your body. I'm going to freeze you. And so you're going to wake up like 500 years later and they're going to have nanobots that you can't die. It's like, we're just going to, you know, so you're going to be like so that's frozen funny and then they're going to wake you up and you're going to just be stuck in nanobots. And, and anytime you try to like do anything bad, the nanobots are just going to go and, and fix you. And I'm like, oh. this is the difference in the, 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 like the, stories that y'all have scott and i have uh we talk about the zombie apocalypse and what we would do, <laughs> what you would do the walking if dead. there was a zombie apocalypse mm, yeah so this does not even come up i don't know <laughs> i mean i mean this is just not <laughs> So that you know, hey, JJ. So you know that when friends, when they, when that happened, that is totally gonna happen to us one day. <laughs> That's it. Nothing. That's not very creative. Oh. Hey, hmm. JJ, JJ. Remember that one time on Big Bang Theory? Yeah, seventy. That's. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, like that. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I remember I, it. And we probably <laughs> need to talk about it again because we haven't we haven't updated it. Like the last time we talked about it, we were our bug out plan was we were gonna head to Washita where our houseboat is, and we were gonna There's cut a lot of spiders. There's a lot of spiders in that houseboat. Yeah, but we were gonna cut the dock off and then oh, have all just, those houseboats. Yeah, yeah, that would be good. Yeah, so you know the thing I tease Chris with is because Chris does want to live to be old, right? He's like, I want to live as long as I possibly can, and so I tease him that you know he's going to go in and 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 I'm just going to like you know no 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 turn off the machine, and they're like no no no, ma'am he he still has a lot of years left. I'm like no no just shut off the machine. He wouldn't want to live like this. I'm like, ma'am he's fine. He just. He just had a like day, you know, day surgery. Just had gas. You know, he just, just he's gas. fine. I'm like, I'm like, just cut off the machine. I'm like, he definitely has told me he doesn't want to live like this. I'm like, fuck. I mean, he he's just under sedation. He's 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 not dying. He's just sleeping. He's <laughs> just sleeping. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, yeah, you're not gonna be on my, my list. Yeah, I don't, we don't. We don't have. We we we. I mean, we. Yeah, that's not happening over here. We're we're just you know, living the dream. Yeah, in California. California, I know. With that amazing sunset, oh, I'm just in Bordeaux. <laughs> Those is wait. Is that a sunset or wildfires? <laughs> that's not funny. <laughs> well, you know that's a that's actually a fantastic question but i i, I, it's I think, a valid question. Question. It would have been I think there's a lot less 
there's a lot less smoke there and I'm yeah. pretty sure that that's a sunset. Yeah. I'm like, yeah. ooh, too soon? Too soon? Okay. Yeah. It's, yeah, I mean, it, they're, they're still happening, so. Are they? Are they still yeah, happening? Just, there was one just, in California that just, yeah. Oh, I didn't even pay attention since we weren't yeah. going there. <laughs> I stopped paying attention. Yeah, but I mean, mm. pretty much if it's summertime, it's burning. So. Well, that's true. That's true. Well, all right, so what do we think of this wine? We've, we've skirted around this. I like, um, I like this. I do too. Yeah, I do I want to say, I think the one, the, mo the highest rated one I did last, previously has been a Bordeaux. Was it? So apparently I like Bordeaux because I really like this. Okay, so Vivino actually has this as a 3.7. Yeah. Um, average price is $25. So this is definitely um, a more expensive one than we've done previously. So, say that. so did you take French? I need you to say this. I did not take French. She took Spanish. Chateau Tour de Mirambo. Mirambo, I assume. Mirambo? I, I'm going to say that's probably not correct. That's Chateau Tour de Marimbo. You don't think it's right? I took French. I didn't. You took that. French? Oh, girl, yeah. Mm. Oh, okay. In 10th grade. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that was a long time ago. And now you're having hip surgery, so. Ooh, Je me me step on again. <laughs> Ooh, ouch. What does my hip have anything to do with my brain? Right? It was in 10th grade, and now it's a long time later. It's a long, it's been again, a while. Again, it's a hip versus well, brain. You know what she could say, Holly? It's a lot yeah, shorter, than, it's it's a lot shorter than you and I. What? I said her comeback should be, well, it's a lot shorter than you and I, the, the two of you. Because she's like four years old. Oh, in, that's true. Yeah, yeah, you could have yeah. definitely you done that. Come back you with that. Like, I just did. I just did. Oh, I didn't. I didn't catch it. I'm sorry. Good one. <laughs> You're like, well, it's four years you were in college. I don't remember anything in the tenth grade. <laughs> oh my gosh! Yeah, there are a lot Again, of my brain must be better than my, uh, my brain's working a little well, better. I, when I was in tenth grade, I had a senior you got, boyfriend. You had a what? I had a boyfriend who was a senior. Yeah, we've heard about your boyfriends. No, we don't no. need to talk about that. Hey, we're not going to bring your diary. All right. All right. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. right. My okay. Is coming out. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, Bordeaux. So, let's see what they say about Bordeaux. Okay. Um, uh, oh, we did talk about Bordeaux before because we were talking about the Lambert Bridge that they do a Bordeaux style that is mostly Merlot. So apparently, you know, you can, any of these five grapes, you can alter the, the content of it and lean more towards one or the other for your Bordeaux style wine. Um, but it says that the tannins in this blend make it an excellent choice to match with steak and other red meat dishes. Keep seasoning simple, think salt and pepper. Which is exactly what Chris does. I mean, what was it that we made the other day? But really, know. can't you say that any yeah. red goes with steak? Like, um, I would argue that like some of the lighter body, medium body wines aren't as great with steak. You want more. The Tempranillo said steak too. Um, yeah, I guess that was, that was the lamb. That was the, wasn't that the lamb? It said steak too. Did it? Mm. Mm -hmm. I mean, I think most people think of red wine with steak, but I mean, so here was the deal. So, you know, Chris and I, when we really started drinking wines, we went to a total wine in um, Washington, DC when we were living there. And that's when we really discovered Zinfandels because I had said, oh, Zinfandel is one of my favorites based on some of the ones that I had um, from Healdsburg rather. And okay. uh, we went to total wine and we you know, got a couple of these Zinfandels and we loved them. And then we went back to total wine and got a bunch more and they were awful. And one of the things that we figured out was that, you know, just because it's a red wine doesn't mean it's going to be full bodied. Um, and that was one of the kind of lessons that we learned when we were first discovering wine is that you kind of have to pay attention to the, the body of wine. And I mean, it could still be good, but it's kind of like me with Pinot Noirs. You know, it's like I have come to appreciate Pinot Noir so long as they're kind of a full bodied and interesting Pinot Noir. But if it's just the light, 
you know, medium bodied Pinot Noir. Again, not that it's awful, but not my favorite. So I kind of go through phases. Because for, you know, it just kind of depends. Like for the longest time, my, Pinot Noir was my favorite. And then it was Cab. And now I'm back on Zimbandel. Mm -hmm. kinda... Lamb chops with herb butter is Helen's recommendation for red Bordeaux. Huh. So I'm going to go ahead. Herb yeah. butter. Herb butter. Herb butter. Herb hmm. butter. Yeah. Well, I was going to say something about, you know, seasoning with just salt and pepper. So, um, you know, Chris has gotten really into meat and smoking meat and, and learning about food and everything. And that's one of the things that he has kind of discovered is when he does a brisket, that he, you know, does a, a better cut of a brisket. So we get like a prime brisket. Um, and all he does is coat it with salt and pepper. But all the people that we've ever brought this brisket to, like I remember I took it to my office um, one day and I mean, they were lining up. Like even my boss, who isn't a meat eater, you know, ate ate up this brisket and they were like, what kind of seasoning do you put on it? And they were floored when he was like, just salt and pepper. So, anyway. I like this brisket. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Was that just, what, was that like, I feel like that story was only to try to get Chris to cook another brisket. Hey, I'm on board with that. I mm. mean, we can, yeah. No, I mean, I feel like, I feel like she started telling the story and all of a sudden it was like, she was thinking about it. She was like, I really need him to make another biscuit, or I mean, a biscuit. A biscuit. I need him to smoke another brisket. Um, no, I got, I got brisket. I got home. I got home. Wait, wait, wait. Should brisket. he make a brisket and you make biscuits? Because you make clearly the best biscuits. Well, I mean, if your kids like them, you know. Oh. I mean, gosh. Oh my gosh. So, Holly, oh, a couple you. weekends ago, Stephanie made biscuits and Jordan and Kara Lee walked them down to my kids. And I mean, Ty Cannon sat there and actually said, These are the best biscuits. These are better than Cracker Barrel. Yeah, they are. didn't didn't you make them for the girls when they spent the night that night? Yeah, that was funny. Um, yes, because now Sarah likes biscuits. Yes, You're you welcome. made Sarah like. And biscuits. I said, I said, listen, girls, all you got to do is just tell your mom to go get self rising flour, you know. And I was like, and, and I said, say it after me. Butter that you shave. Self rising flour. And she goes. I'm not, my mom's not going to do that. Mm -mm. And I went, mm -mm. yes, she will. Your mom cooks. Mm -hmm. Why would she say I wouldn't do that? I can make it. Because she, Holly. I would be pies the other day crying out loud. <laughs> because she didn't want to have to remember the recipe. She was like, totally like, what? Yeah. I mean, why is she, why is this lady standing in front of me or Carolyn's mom recipe. expecting me to my mom, remember? Not do this. Yeah. But I, I was, but it seriously is the easiest Shame. recipe on the face of the planet. It's yeah, the you easiest have, recipe. You'll have I to give me that. And she make. ate two of them, and she said she didn't like biscuits. I said you're. So I said, wait a second. You're helping me make biscuits, and you're gonna not eat, try one because you don't like biscuits. I said, I, I'm. That's not okay. Uh, you have to eat one. <laughs> yeah. So now every time I'm up with, I don't I usually do the homemade biscuits. I, 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 apparently, I need your recipe. So. Uh, but I just do the cans, and now every time I do canned biscuits, she wants some because Miss Stephanie made her like them. Do you, do you make frozen? Do you make sure you have honey available because that's she's the... never asked for honey. I have honey, but she Gabby wants on one side butter and then grape and strawberry jelly on the other, and then she the puts them together. I it's love Gabby. Fun. She's a mixer. She mixes things. She loves, she mixes. I love me a mixer. Mm -hmm. And my, uh, what kind of condiment do you want? Um, mm -hmm. I want mayonnaise, ketchup, and mayonnaise. Ketchup and honey mm. mustard. And then she oh, mixes yeah. it all oh, together. I love oh, me some Gabby. Gross. Love that. Oh, I love it, love it. Yep. She's girl gross. after my own heart. But she's all about mixing. And, um, and I will well, say that Gabby has never met a biscuit that she didn't like. Right. Right. Okay, well, Same part. I mean, we're just, we just need to have a little baking party. I mean, I buy frozen biscuits. Those are pretty good. So what do you think would yeah. go with this wine? Hmm. Cheddar. Cheddar. Oh, a cheddar biscuit. Here. An herb. Oh, a garlic. Yes. A cheese and garlic biscuit. Uh-huh. Mm. 
Mm. No, you know the last time options. you know those biscuits I did this last time, I actually I melted butter on top. I typically don't do that, but my oven once I took that second pan or the first pan out, that second pan got real hot real quick, and I just mm. wasn't prepared for that time mm -hmm. difference. And I brought it out, and I was like, oh my gosh, they're really brown on top. And so I was like, well, I'll just soften it with some butter because that's what it actually says to put butter on the top of the mm -hmm. biscuit before you cook it. But I don't typically don't do that. And I did it, and I'm like. And then when I ate a bite of it, I was like, oh, now that's, that's, that, I mean, that's, that's worth good. getting behind. Yeah. So maybe, maybe a little salted butter with some cheese and herbs in the batter. Mm -hmm. I think we should do some, that. some brisket and some biscuits <laughs> and some Bordeaux. Bordeaux. The bees. You're welcome. A, a bee, You're a welcome. Bee. Sold. Briskets, biscuits with Bordeaux. There's your phrase. That's the name of the next party. Bam. You know, that's next what party. I that's what I call the bed when I tell the girls. <laughs> I say, go get in the biscuit. Because, yeah. you know, there's oh, two layers. I went, I went a completely a different way. Oh. Were you? I don't want to know. You said that's what I call the bed. JJ, you uh -oh. did say that. But uh -oh. JJ, well, I did, JJ. But it, JJ, when you go get in the biscuit, he used to, when I first met him, he said that, and I said, that is weird. No, it's not. It's a, makes total it's sense. Bed. It's a bed. I go, I go a completely different place when you say go get here's, in the biscuit. Here's, <laughs> this is the bottom part of the biscuit. The sheets and the covers of the top part of the biscuit. You get in the biscuit. <laughs> Wait, do that, do that, do that hand motion again. I got to do it this way and make, because I, I always, I always want to go opposite, but you Right, right. And the biscuit. And the biscuit. Are you ready to get in the warm biscuit? Ooh, there you go again. Biscuit. Okay. <laughs> there it is. Quote there of the was. day. <laughs> Not word of the day. Quote of the day. Get, get in the warm in biscuit. The biscuit. Go get in the warm biscuit. No, it's not a go get. It's just get. Get it. Get it. That's <laughs> get in the warm biscuit. Get, get in the biscuit. Get it That's, in the you biscuit. You gotta say it like that. You gotta go. You gotta go. Yes. You added. You added a word. Get, get it in, in the biscuit. biscuit. And the fit, you know, and just the way you say biscuit. I mean, you know, it's like the it's like the spelling of biscuit, right? B i s q or c u i t. Like, where do we get kit? Where do we get biscuit from? C u i t. Shouldn't it be biscuit? <laughs> Deep Thoughts by Jessica Cannon. <laughs> Bisquit. It should just be a cube. Bisquit. Well, I mean, it's just like all those other weird words. Like, why do we call press, spelled Prescott? Prescott. We call it Prescott. Yeah. Or, Prescott. or giraffe. If anybody from, if anybody from out of town goes through, they go, well, I went through Prescott. And I'm like, where the hell are you talking about? It ain't Prescott. Prescott. Yeah. There's no such yeah. thing as Prescott, Arkansas. Yeah. It's Prescott. Prescott. Yeah. Yeah, we had a we had a, a, a street in in Austin that was called Man Shack, okay, but it is spelled M A N C H A C A, like Manchaka, but for whatever reason they call it Man Shack. It's like where did you get that? Or it's like in Boston they call it Worcester. <laughs> there's like there's like six other syllables in that word, <laughs> but it's no, Worcester. It was a long time ago, but Scott was talking about somebody he worked with was trying to do a deal with somebody that was from El Dorado, El Dorado. Mm -hmm. El Dorado. I was trying to do the opposite. Yeah, El Dorado. Yeah. And they called it El Dorado. El Dorado. Yeah. And Scott Done. was like, well, no, no wonder they didn't do the deal with you. You <laughs> called it the wrong <laughs> El Dorado. El Dorado. El Dorado. Mm -hmm. And that's so weird. That's so mm -hmm. strange. <laughs> so strange. Okay. So what are we going to rate this one? I don't like it. I'm gonna go. What did we decide? What vintage is this? This is a 2018. Hey, we're on a roll. We have two in a row that weren't 2019 ones. Mm -hmm. Um. Bless you. I think I'm gonna go 3.1. I'm gonna go 
asked me to get a sip of water because I'm a lot higher than that. Okay. Yeah, I am too. I'm thinking like 3.8. Wow, I like 3.8. Okay. I like it. Okay. Good. 3.8. Good to know. Okay. Is that writing all these down? No, I was just going to watch them later. <laughs> But we have this fabulous book that we're supposed to be writing this down, and I have not written anything. I think uh, I started. It's okay because we're not going to buy any of these, probably. So, I mean, yeah. okay. So I washed my mouth and I put it back in there. Do you have French friends? <laughs> I know that sounded really bad. It did. And you're you're doing good with wait, those stuff. Wait, I like we're it. okay with getting into the biscuit, but if I say French rinse. No. no, I I said I put a little water in there, rinsed it, and then I put oh, it back in my oh, mouth. Okay, 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 okay. Yes, yes, yes. Put I'm, it I'm there. I, I rinsed I'm, it. I put a little. I put it I back rinsed, in. I, I put a little water in, rinsed yeah. it, and then I put it back in my mouth. I'm tracking. I'm tracking. I'm tracking. Yeah. Um, Chris, Chris is talking about biscuit in bed, and he's like, "Yeah, that's going to be a thing now." No, no, no. That's a thing here. Oh, okay. Yeah. Getting the biscuit. Yeah, JJ Chris says and I, who are not from here, we're like, JJ oh, says he, it. He's like, I've um, heard this before. I, I'm going to go with 3.4. 3.4, okay. Holly, would you decide? It's my highest one yet. Um, 3.8. Yeah, I said 3.8. 3.8, okay. Uh, Vivino gave it a um, 3.7. Oh! <gasps> yeah. So Vino says 3.7 and um, yeah, okay. Okay. Oh, yawning. Oh, no, 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 no. no. There's no yawning on film. Nope. No. Nope. Well, I'm anticipating going under the knife tomorrow. It's okay. okay. Yeah, it's kind of like, you still don't know what time? 12. 12, okay. Well, oh, okay, so. It's a so, nooner. So. <laughs> Um, hopefully, I'm be, I'm hopefully we we will be, um, you will be up to drinking <laughs> wine tomorrow night. Um, I will say that I'm probably going to say that is fine. I was going to say that it was the last time I had surgery. Anyway, so I had eye surgery done. I know you guys have heard this story, but our followers have not. Um, I had eye surgery <laughs> done, uh, before our wedding in 2012 and, um, I stayed with Chris in his apartment in, um, in Virginia, got my eye surgery done, came home, and they, you know, gave me pain medicine, and, you know, it was a little bit more painful than I thought it was, but I was like, well, I'll just take this pain medicine so that I don't hurt, um, and we, oh, was this post party? Was it? No, it must not have been. Um, anyway, we had, we had bottles of champagne to drink, and uh, <gasps> I ended up drinking. Good day, yeah. Oh yeah, the night of. So I had my eye surgery, post-surgery, came home, took my pain medicine because I was hurting, drank a bottle of champagne, made him watch the Twilight movies. Could you see anything? No, not very much, but I squinted enough to see <laughs> Taylor Lautner on the screen and got completely intoxicated. Um such that I don't remember the entire night. We ordered, we ordered lots of stuff on the internet that then arrived, you know, several days later. So I had gone back home at that point, which I was living in South Carolina and, and, and Chris like, <laughs> you know, called me the other day. He's like, Hey, so the packages have arrived. You know, here's the things I'm like, packages. He was like, yeah, you know, it was like the stuff. And I'm like, the stuff what are you talking about he's like you don't remember and I'm like remember what what are you talking about and he was like you ordered a bunch of stuff when you were here you know and had it delivered she keeps to saying stuff. stuff that's very it, odd it did you just go down to Amazon no it was what did we order for? like fab.com like that was like fab.com at the time so it was like t-shirts and posters and things that I don't need post posters. I have, I have to poster. say, I have a poster. Where are these posters? Well, some of it's in our bedroom. 
some other things. So some of it we've kept, other things we've given away because I really didn't need them. Um, I have yeah. to say, Jess, being a physician, you have some really bad habits. <laughs> From the not brushing your teeth at night to the <laughs> taking pain meds and drinking a bottle of champagne, I'm kind of rethinking. You know, so. like, um, maybe I should transfer my children. <laughs> <laughs> She's the most understandable one there is. I mean, this is the thing. You need somebody like her talking to your children. You kind of do. I mean, let's be honest. Like, she's done it all. So she needs to make, she's making sure she covers her bases when she's talking to your children. So anyway, I had no idea. I mean, like, I, like theoretically, because I, I mean, like, you remember, I was a goody two shoes in school. Like, I've never done drugs. I've never done any of this stuff. So this was my first chance to really, like, live on the edge. I had prescription pills and alcohol. And I was like, why not? <laughs> this is so Don't try this. Now. And, and. She had, like, two blocks. I was gonna say I had like two glasses, two glasses of, of alcohol, and you know, like two Percocets or something. So the like that. so the take home message, followers, is that mm -hmm. when Sorry. when you yes. decide to watch tomorrow. Yes. So I digress. So I'm hoping that Stephanie takes her pain meds tomorrow, <laughs> <laughs> and then we drink our wine because I really want to see what it looks like from that perspective. Because <laughs> I didn't remember any of this. You want to see what it looks night. like. I do. What is I'm kind of like, I won't even be sitting up straight. <laughs> well. I mean, I was laying on the couch squinting like this for the most part. Okay. okay. Um, well, I mean, nobody will know. I'll just have a virtual background. It's fine. Well, and that's the thing is like how I, how I even saw these things to push the like buy button. No idea. But I bought a lot of stuff. All right. Mm -hmm. yeah. no, I won't so, be buying a lot. That was, that was my story. Sorry. I'm I'm sorry. Buy, I'm, the I'm one time, buying. the one time I walked on the edge, Holly, the one time. The yeah. only time. The okay. only time. Otherwise I'm pretty boring. Boring. Right. Boring. Boring. Loser. So, all right. Anyway, Bordeaux. Cheers. Bordeaux. I like Cheers. it. Okay. Cheers. Good to know.